NBA 2K19, the game with which 2K Sports redeemed itself with basketball fans. But just how good of a game is it? Stick around to find out. So, NBA 2K19 is out now on all major platforms and we've been playing it religiously. There's a lot we like about the new game and we're genuinely impressed with how much of an upgrade 2K19 feels compared to the last year's game. We'll even go as far as to say that 2K18 felt like a beta for 2K19. So what makes the new game so good? Well, for starters, let's talk about my career. Our journey begins in China because our player did not get drafted into the NBA. After performing well in China, the road takes us to the G League, and then finally we work our way up to the big league, the NBA. Now the thing about my career is that the overall writing of the story has taken an immense leap forward. I felt genuinely invested in the story and actually cared about Fort Wayne, Indiana, the Midwest, and the Mad Ants because of how everything was portrayed. The entire setting and atmosphere made me truly want to give it my all to the local team, and the voice acting and dramatic threat is finally where it should be. There's no cringy dialogue, no over the top dancing, and most important there's no be fresh need I say more so once you get to the NBA you get to choose your team and your contract is fully negotiable how many VC you'll be earning how many years you want to sign with that team and so on even though they didn't exactly offer me the best conditions I chose to roll with Oklahoma City Thunder what can I say I'm a Westbrook fan don't lynch me in the comments please being able to negotiate your contract from the outset is very welcome indeed as the game already gives you a real sense of control over your career so great job 2k with this year's my career mode in his interview with us, Rob Jones, the senior producer of NBA 2K, promised that VC, the game's virtual currency, would be scaled down in 2K19. We're happy to report that he is true to his word. Even though VC is still of course very much present in the new game, it's nowhere near as harshly implemented as it was in 2K18 where honestly it was a nightmare. For example, you no longer have to pay to get or even to preview your new haircut. It's now free to charge. Also, the overall grind for VC has been improved and it's now much easier to get stacked up to use it in the game. Like Jones said in our interview, if you have a 90 rated amateur who just opened his wallet and can't play well at all, then I don't want that guy on my team. I want the experienced player who's gonna play the way I expect him to. So that's gonna be one of the things that's gonna be different. And different it really is. There's now a major skill gap in 2K19 that cannot be narrowed by just whipping out your wallet and paying your way to stardom. Another improvement we really like is that we can finally skip the cutscenes in my career. Even though we like this here story and the way it's portrayed, we know a lot we'll want to keep things moving, so skipping scenes and getting right back on court is definitely a handy feature. Loading times are quicker too, certainly on the PS4 Pro and Xbox One X we're using. We'll always want them to be even quicker of course, but any improvement is a major plus for console gamers. Now let's talk about gameplay. 2K19 immediately feels and plays much smoother than before, absolutely crucial for a sports game. The game's physics and especially player movement have been completely overhauled from the last year's version. Now it feels much more physical. Another clear improvement is in defense which finally plays a role in a 2K game. Last year defense was pretty much non-existent but now steals and blocks are far more likely to come off. Stealing the ball in key situations such as during the hesitation dribble for example happens way more often and means players can't just smash the dribble buttons anymore. Those who enjoy playing defense and basketball will find their experience with 2K19 to be much more rewarding. The notorious blow-by animations have been reduced as well. You now actually have to set plays up and call for screens if you want to finish at the rim, and being a more physical game than before, this is no easy task. All of these changes add to the sports simulation formula that NBA 2K is renowned for, so hardcore basketball fans are almost certainly going to be happier. Speaking of simulation, NBA 2K has always been known as king in the player likeness department, and it still is. Dribbling with Kyrie Irving, going for a dunk with Westbrook, and shooting with Steph Curry looks almost Instagram good. 
graphics is one place where NBA 2K19 absolutely shines. The match commentary too is as fluid and exciting as ever with Kobe Bryant and Kevin Garnett making guest appearances to really help capture the atmosphere of an actual NBA game. Still on graphics and animations, one thing which broke immersion in 2K18 was the dreaded animation clipping, the situation where characters morph through each other. In 2K19, however, things seem much better. Though it still happens from time to time, it's nowhere near as common or intrusive to gameplay as before, a major improvement. But of course, NBA 2K19 is not a perfect game. There's a couple things we noticed which we hope will be fixed with updates and patches. The first on our list is the extremely harsh teammate grading system in my career. The smallest of mistakes, such as a bad block attempt for example, will drop your grade significantly. While we don't mind a challenge in getting your teammate grade all the way to A, the penalty right now for minor errors is much too steep and could be cut by 30% if not more. And speaking of challenges, we think the lower difficulty settings playing against the CPU are unreasonably hard and could make it a real grind for newcomers and casual players. There should be a more distinct difference between playing on Pro and Hall of Fame so that every tier of player can get their fun out of playing a regular match against the CPU. All in all though, NBA 2K19 is one hell of an improvement over the last year's title. With the game being more physical than before, with gorgeous graphics and lifelike animations and downsides that can easily be fixed with a patch in the future, we give NBA 2K19 a well-deserving 9 out of 10 and hope 2K Sports keep building on the foundation they've laid with this year's game. But let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. What are some things that you like and dislike about NBA 2K19? We'd love to hear from you and please make sure to head over to Alcatraz com for much more content like this and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos thanks a lot for watching this is Sabriel and see you in the next video